Careful, kid. All right, watch it. I'm gonna send the ladder down. Hey, right, heads up. Got it. Get it? There. Thanks. Here, give me your guns. Can't take them out on the street. Ah, uh, right. Much as I'd like to. Okay, I think we're clear. Come on. We gotta make ourselves scarce before any more of them show up. All right, up here. This way. Easy, kid. Stay away. Stay away. What's wrong with him? They drugged him. What? Come on, we gotta get him out of here. Come on, stop. Touch me! All right. No. We just, we just want to help. Get away! Get away from me. He's not here, Drake. You're on your own now. Sorry. Trust us. Follow me. No, I won't go. Don't resist. Where is this? You're with us. Just listen to me. You know what we want. Don't let, don't let, don't let. I won't let them hurt you. Where is it? No. Give them to us. I don't know. Welcome back. I don't recommend making a scene. You're not exactly here legally, remember? Greatness from small beginnings. <laughs> Beneath that cocky exterior, you're still the same scared, filthy little runaway, aren't you? Skip the mind games. You don't know me. In fact, I suspect I know you better than anyone. Mr. Drake. Of course, that's not your real name, is it? But we won't dwell on that. Mother commits suicide. Father surrenders son to the state at the age of five. Entrusted to the St. Francis Boys' Home. 
it's also Dickensian. <laughs> oh. Don't worry. She's of no interest to us. Unless, of course, we need to apply a little pressure. What do you want from me? Well, as much as it pains me to admit it, I need your help to find Victor Sullivan. Right. We already know he has the coordinates to find Iran. How do you know that? <laughs> you told us, Nathan. It seems your loyalty isn't as firm as you'd like to think it is. What about his? What? Wait. What are you trying to pull? Nothing. It's just that, well, we've had you in our clutches for quite some time now. And he hasn't exactly mounted a rescue. He didn't rescue you back in Cartagena either. He just saw something he could exploit. I know what you're trying to do. Trust me. Victor is only ever in it for Victor. It's a cold, hard fact. I discovered it 20 years ago. I'm surprised it's taken you this long to figure it out. You're wasting your time, lady. Fair enough. But ask yourself, when he scooped you off the streets of Columbia 20 years ago, did he save you from that life? Or did he just doom you to this one? Ah. Well, we've located Sullivan on the other side of the city. I'm sorry, Nathan. It seems you've been removed from the equation.
Damn it. Surprise, asshole. Excuse me. There he is. I think you lost me, didn't you? Come on, Talbot, this is getting old. I got here to go. We'll give one up the hot. Sort of. I was sort of there. Watch them. يا صباح الفلافل والحمص والببغ النور. Remember me? Ramses. You should thank me, my friend. Uh, right. Thanks. No, really. The English lady bade me to get rid of you. But me, I'm a nice guy. I saved your life. Right now, I am the only friend you got. Now you figure I owe you something. Is that it? Smart guy. I like that. You are a way ahead of me. It is really a simple question. Aram of the pillars. <sighs> of course. Where is it? I don't know, buddy. Bullshit. Look, even if I did know, my life wouldn't be worth very much once I told you, now would it? You insult me. You're a pirate. And a good businessman. Give me some respect. Let's try this again. Where is Aram, Nathan? Look, you can torture me all you want. Okay. But I can't tell you what I don't know. Maybe so. We'll see if your friend is more cooperative 